Well, hello friends. I am here to share the love with some fellow YouTubers. So February seems like a great month to put out some other YouTubers who I watch and follow who have inspired me, who encouraged me in my homemaking, in my faith, in my motherhood, and my simple living. And so I wanted to share a list with you of who I watch when I can. I don't watch it as often as I would like, but when I get the chance to, who inspires me. And they're not in any particular order, and nor are they any size range. Some are a lot larger scale YouTubers than myself, and some are about the same size. So let's just get started with who I want to share with you today. Okay, first off is Natalie Bennett. She is a homeschool mom of three. She's a homemaker and she does a lot of simple living because they just decluttered their previous home. She did a massive um, decluttering series on her channel and so she's more of a minimalist in a sense, but so encouraging. She is very open about her faith and I just love that. And it's so fun to watch her and her decluttering and her daily living. The next is Jennifer Scott from The Daily Connoisseur. So she has so much um, chicness and I enjoy hearing encouragement and how to live a life of chic, being chic in what you are doing and who you are, whether you're a stay-at-home mom, a working mom, and just how you live your life for um, the most of it and just making yourself presentable and um, making your home presentable. So she is a good one to watch for encouragement on that. And she's written several books, Madam Chic series, some for kids as well. And I just enjoy listening to her. In that same vein, there is Inspired by Nikki. I did a collab with her several years ago already. And she is a very fashionable, well put together lady. She does a lot of homemaking and cleaning and inspiration and goal setting and is just someone who has so much class and elegance and dresses so well, always wearing dresses, which is so neat that she can do that. But Inspired by Nikki is a channel I recommend if you're looking for some of that type of content as well. Leah or Home is more of a home decor uh, channel, I guess you would say. She does do some homemaking, some simple living, so very similar name as mine with the simple living, homemaking, things like that, and lifestyle. She has a very um, simple cottage style decor that is just really cute and classy, and so if you're looking for decor type inspiration, check out Leah or Home. And Miranda Christine also has some great inspiration. You know her because I've collabed with her several times. She changes out her decor so often, so seasonally, and it's fun to just see how she can curate her home with thrifted and antique pieces so well in that vintage cottage style. And so she's got a lot of good decor style inspiration. She does some daily life as well. So just a fun lady to watch and good inspiration on decorating. The next channel is Because It Matters. She is a young mom of three littles. I think she just had her third actually. So about same as me. Uh, has two toddlers and maybe she had her third I think already so very close in age she just shares her heart on her channel and about homemaking and her faith and living a homestead lifestyle that I think they have a homestead anyways so just a very open channel about the things that I think matter in our life and so you can find some encouragement on that channel as well. Then there's my go-to, Farmhouse on Boone. I think I've watched Lisa since the beginning that I started watching YouTube, and so she is where I got a lot of inspiration to start my YouTube channel, to start my blog. I took her blogging course even, and so she just is the one who got me inspired to do my sourdough. So a lot of her recipes I will do for sourdough and um, we don't have a homestead but I enjoy watching her homesteading 
I love the natural way she lives, the organic foods, you know, what we can do with that. Um, this is how we take care of ourselves and our home. And in that line as well, the Elliott Homestead, similar content as Farmhouse on Boone. I love their um, homestead, watching that and how they raise their children on their homestead, how she decorates her home, very different than me, but still that collected, thrifted, antique style in a little cottage. And I also enjoy Shay Elliott on the podcast, Homemaker Chic with Parisian Farm Girl. So that is partially why I like both. And it's just a fun connection to have and a lot of inspiration from the Elliott Homestead on my gardening. And I love gardening. So if you're needing some inspiration on that and food preserving, you know, lots of things like that, check out the Elliott Homestead. There are more, like Hillary from the Old World Home. You guys know her. I have collabed with her several times. Such a great, encouraging woman of faith and shares her day and does some Vlogmases and some Vlogtobers. So you get to see her every day in several of those months. And there are many more thrifters that I love to watch when I can or when I've collabed with them. There are just so many who I want to share the love with, but my list will go on and on and on. These are some right now that I thought you might enjoy hearing who I watch and go and check them out to find encouragement and inspiration for yourself. And if you already do watch some of these ladies, then that is wonderful. They are some sweet ladies who have a lot of good content to share. So hope you enjoyed watching this Share the Love video. It's something different, something that hopefully you can use and go back to if you're looking for someone else to watch as well along with my channel. If you did forget, don't forget to check out my blog at davykillian.com. I'm posting about once a week on there. I just put up a recent easy dump chili recipe. It would be great for the winter months here for a Super Bowl party. So check out my blog. Hopefully going to be continually posting there for encouragement of homemaking. Join the community I have there by subscribing and hopefully you can connect more in that way. Well, I love you guys and I will talk with you in my next one.